Hello guys, in this tutorial I'll walk you through the process of creating a playlist and displaying that playlist on your homepage so your channel gets to look a little bit more organized and better looking for those who come to it. So let's go to it and click on our YouTube studio and create a playlist from our videos. Now, you see I have several playlists that I've done before in order for my content to be more organized. So let's do, a, for example, a drone playlist. And we've created a playlist that is called drone and we'll edit this description saying this is a playlist of drone footage and save. We come to your videos and we choose for example this this one we add to that list. We can add them to several different playlists and it's done. Drone, drone, and drone. These were several drone shots that I've done. Um, and now you can come back to your channel and customize your channel. And let's go down here and where it says add a section, you can click on add a section and when you select a single playlist on the horizontal row, you can choose vertical list. Um, and we can choose from a different channel, for example, imagine that you have several channels, channels you want to go and get a playlist from another channel or even use a playlist created by another user, um, you can enter the URL here and it will display that playlist. But in this case, we want to display one of our own. So let's go and just click on the drone playlist that we've created before. And now we can organize it by putting it up and down and leaving it wherever you wish. I'm going to take it up there and show you how you can delete it because I'm not going to use it. Um, so you can click on that pencil and come here and delete it. And that's basically it. That's how you do it. Now there are several things that you can do to improve the overall looks of your of channel, like choosing a good picture to put up here. I took this picture in New York from the Brooklyn and Manhattan Bridge. I like it. It says welcome here. So it's uh, welcoming you all to my channel and um, and that's it and you can um, edit these links also because you can see it will take you to my Instagram or to my Facebook page or to my website if you click it or even to our store in Teespring which is uh, awesome to have the ability to show people that we have this stuff here even to my Spotify account so you can go and listen to my songs or my musical work you can also um, do a different video for new visitors and uh, returning subscribers. It will display differently if you're a new visitor of the channel or if you're a returning subscriber. This video should be uh, a video of you presenting yourself. I'm preparing this video um, where I talk about all the stuff that I'm doing like photo, video, uh, music, my drum marathons, all that stuff that I'm doing, I'm going to talk about it in a video and it will show here uh, so new subscribers or new visitors of the channel may know who I am. Um, this is a cool way for you to do that. If your channel is based on just one thing, then you should do just the same. You should introduce yourself to people. Now I'm taking YouTube more seriously lately and I'm trying to learn a lot about this and I've been learning a lot from all the different channels that exist. So here are some of the cool channels that I, will advi I would advise you to go and look. Casey Neistat, he has a, a video that you should watch which is do what you can't. 
you could start with that one because it's a very cool video for you to know a little bit of Casey. Um, Peter McKinnon, he has a very interesting channel on photo, video, gear, um, editing on Lightroom, all that stuff. Uh, Gary Vaynerchuk, uh, known as Gary V, uh, has a channel about how to increase your presence on social networks and how to be an entrepreneur, how to develop your brand, all that good stuff. Make Art Now is a channel by Joshua. He takes video into a very different level and he introduces you to uh, gear in in a very particular way. He's very interesting. You should watch his content. Parker Wallback will show you how to do a lot of different stuff in video. So if you're interested in improving your technique, um, he's the guy to go to. Even um, setting up um, this kind of look for your videos. You can check out his content about how to do this, um, how to uh, get the proper lighting, and um, he talks about all this, all this stuff. Matt Johnson, who is Matt? He shows uh, Premiere uh, editing techniques, but he also shows gear, and um, so it is very. It's a very interesting channel. Um, he is a wedding photographer and videographer. He already came to Portugal, uh, he, and he has a very funny uh, personality. You should totally go and, th and see um, his episodes. Think Media, they not only talk about video technique, how to film properly, how to light, um, use lighting and all, uh, all the stuff that you need to, to make a, a good video, but they also talk about the um, improvement of your channel they have a lot of, of tips that are very useful for you to grow and digital rev was the channel that saved me when i was looking for lenses and i didn't know which lenses to choose i came here they have uh reviews about almost every kind of lens there is and um so it was a huge help Maddie Apuja he was working with Peter McKinnon for, for a long time. They have now uh, started working separately, but they still have this podcast together. But he works on um, travel videos. He also helps you with grading as well. Um, so there's a lot of cool content there on that channel. Potato Jet, um, he looks like the guy from Up. He's a very funny guy that does videos on gear, on um, also techniques on how to improve your videos. You can do a lot of uh, great stuff with, um, with the knowledge these guys provide you. So these are highly valuable channels. You should go and watch their content and it's completely worth it. Uh, I've spent hours uh, going through their content and uh, trying to learn a bit more. I'm still the, trying to develop my my overall look and trying to improve every every time. So thank you so much for watching until the end. And if you like this content, give me a like and uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And um, that's it. See you on the next time. Bye bye.